Hey guys, it's Jordan with National Speed, and today we're answering a question that we get quite often. Do I really need long tube headers with an upgraded camshaft? And the answer seems pretty obvious, right? Of course you do. But we realized that we had never really tested the opposite approach. And as luck would have it, we have the perfect opportunity this week in the shop to answer that question. So back in August of last year, we set this 2015 Chevrolet Corvette Stingray up with our camshaft package, and only our camshaft package. After the owner Blake encountered an AFM lifter failure, he decided to upgrade rather than just repair. He knew that eventually he wanted to add some supporting modifications, but for the time being, just wanted to keep the car otherwise stock. And with that in mind, we went a little bit more aggressive with the camshaft selection than we normally would and installed a Guatney SS3. And the car performed as you would expect, laying down 456 wheel horsepower and 439 pound-feet of torque. Definitely a nice increase over a stock C7, but it was obviously limited by the 100% stock intake and exhaust. And when Blake reached back out a couple months later to talk about long tube headers, we were absolutely pumped that we had the opportunity to finally answer this question. Now, fast forward to this week, and Blake's Corvette is back in the shop for Stainless Works 1 and 7 8 long tube headers. Up first, John installs the headers with OEM GM gaskets, NGK LTR 6IX-11 spark plugs, Hinson spark plug wires, and DEI protective boots. Next, onto the dyno to see what kind of gains we're looking at here. All right guys, we can finally answer this question. Do you really need long tube headers when you upgrade your camshaft? Well, of course you do. With the long tube headers, output jumped up to 493.6 wheel horsepower and 457.73 pound-feet of torque. That's peak gains over camshaft only of 37 wheel horsepower and 18 pound-feet of torque, with maximum gains coming in at 42 wheel horsepower at 6,500 RPM. And are you ready for this? 58 pound-feet of torque at 3,000 RPM. Absolutely crazy increase with long tube headers. All right, and keep in mind, this is still on a 100% stock intake system, so there's some seriously low-hanging fruit here for more power. All right, guys, and there you have it. Long tube headers on your LT1-equipped vehicle are absolutely worth the investment. And with that all said, we hope you enjoyed this video. And if you're ready for more out of your GM vehicle, we're ready to help you get there. Reach out today to learn more.